Nerds, uh, what's going on everyone? Uh, hey, how's everybody doing? Figured we'd do a video blog talking about things that we're doing on the channel and things that are going, you know, in life and all that stuff and what's being planned and all those things. It's been a little while since we did one. Uh, I do want to talk about, first off, uh, a big thank you for everybody subbing and all the new subs actually. We, when we left Twitch, we were like 908 or something like that and now we're at like 980 so that's a huge boost for literally just a few months so thank you very much for all that which is awesome uh so speaking of that we're going to come down to our restructuring so i'm just pulling this up over here so i can kind of take a look and see what exactly i am doing because <laughs> the gods forbid if i actually remembered or wrote this down or i think oh non-script non-script and raw just raw 981 actually Really appreciate that. Thank you for all those who have enjoyed the music, by the way, too. The uh, new songs are, I'm having a lot of fun with them. So I've got plans for more, without a doubt. And uh, so we'll see some stuff soon. Probably this week, we should see the new Tribes of Midgard song I had planned out, uh, which is cool. And we'll kind of go from there. So, all right. So what's going to happen with the channel itself? Well, nothing in terms of like big changes or anything like that, uh, except for what we're going to be doing on the channel. And so I wrote a new about section. I figured I would just kind of go over that and give a good idea of what's going on moving forward and stuff. So we've got uh, original music, as we've been seeing. We're going to be definitely doing more of that. Uh, that are based off different games. I've been really enjoying like coming up with things on gaming and stuff like that. I got a cat. I got a cat I'm flying up here. But uh, yeah, I really enjoyed making music on like Tribes of Midgard, and I have intentions of other ones I want to do. So maybe something on Valhalla, uh, something down the line for other games coming down and stuff like that. So depending on what the game is and everything. So kind of go from there. And then with that, we'll probably do some like with screenshots or some gameplay in it, kind of like its own little music video thing and stuff. So that's something cool to be working into, which would be cool. Uh, top five reasons is changing over to top reasons. Uh, not everything has a top five and there's still stuff I want to talk about and whatnot. So we're going to be moving out into top reasons. That is going to also kind of broaden the perspective first uh the spectrum of stuff which is going to be cool so we'll be able to do more things like top weapons in dark souls stuff like that uh top classes to play you know things you know all those kinds of things so we're going to kind of broaden this perspective uh, perspective is this a word i'm saying <laughs> perspective broaden the perspective i can speak really i can i'm going to broaden the perspective and of what we're going to be doing and going from there starting guides as we've already seen part one of i have started doing starting guides so i used to do these kind of back in the day when i was like kind of younger to youtube i did some guides when bloodborne was first around i did a big guide on howing how to summon a friend or how to summon yourself to a friend and stuff like that or, you know how to get summoned and how to pvp and stuff like that and it blew up like crazy and then on top of it there was another one i built uh, i think it was how to chat or talk to people like multiple people in um oh, what the heck was that game i don't know it was some older mmo from back in the day that was on xbox and now it came to everything and stuff like that it was that futuristic one they were going to do a television show on and everything like that. i can't remember the name of it offhand. but uh, i did a start uh, like a guide on that and uh, the guides really, really took off a long time ago. And I want to get back into doing that. A lot of people like my info when I do these kinds of things. And they say we're, you know, pretty straight to the point. Unlike my vlogs. <laughs> Unlike my raw vlogs. But uh, yeah, they're pretty straight to the point and stuff. So, and I want to go over, there's a lot of Souls-like games that I've always talked about how I feel like people would definitely enjoy games like Neo, games like Dark Souls, games like Bloodborne, things like that. But the only problem is there's a lot of bells and whistles, right? So when you walk in, you're kind of like, well, I don't know. There's a lot of stuff I have to kind of like, what does this mean? What does this mean? And not everything is, of course, because these games are kind of built that way. Not everything is handed to you or you're not really guided 
per se. And I feel like going and checking out a starting guide is not a bad thing, you know. It's and there are no spoilers because I don't want to spoil anything because I want people to enjoy the game for the first time on their own. But it's nice to have that sense of knowing what you're walking into instead of just diving in. Some people love to dive in. Some people want that that reassurance of knowing what they're walking into and having having that knowledge as they're walking in and knowing, okay, well, this is a game where I have to slow down. This is a game where I will die, things like that. Some people look at it, like I've known that people have jumped into Souls games and thinking it's like an Assassin's Creed or a Witcher or something, right? Where you just like, I'm going in, I'm killing everything. But come to find out, if you do it that way, you're going to die even more than, you know, the other way. So, so that's pretty much a big thing. Um, and then, of course, do streams off and on. As we always do, trophy hunting, taking pictures, uh, making music, things like that. So, and those will be, again, when I'm in the mood, when I feel like it. So, now let's talk about an ordered schedule because we need one. Uh, although I'm terrible at these sometimes, and my God, my track record is not the greatest when it comes. So, what I've done is I decided to make it easy. This way, this will work out in a lot of good ways. I'm gonna do three videos a week. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Now, those could be anything from a starting guide to uh, a music sit thing or photos or, you know, whatever, whatever, a vlog, anything. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Always expect a video on those days. I'm going to try I'm going to try my hardest to make sure a video gets out Monday, Wednesday, and Friday and keep that rolling. This way, You've got a day in between to decide to watch when you want to watch, knowing that there's something new coming out on Wednesday. So, like, if it's Monday and stuff and a video comes out, you're like, okay, well, I can either watch this tonight, I could save it, knowing there's something else coming out on Wednesday, and then knowing something else coming out on Friday. And then you got the weekend, whatever, because the weekend is always a live stream on Saturday anyway, uh, except for this Saturday, I just wasn't really feeling it. But a weekend is usually always a live stream anyway because we usually do our Saturday adventures with Mage, myself, and we've been playing Tribes of Midgard. We played a whole lot of it Saturday, so <laughs> which was really cool. Um, but yeah, so that is the plan moving forward. So Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, expect videos. Expect content, best way to say it. And then you view that content when you want. Now, I'm not going to set any times to them either because that's, like I said, I'm making this as easy as I can so I can stick to it and keep it flowing. So I'm not going to, so what I don't want to do is I don't want to say starting guide every Wednesday or this every Monday. You know what I mean? Like, I'm just going to say content Monday, Wednesday, Friday, whenever they get put out, whether it's in the afternoon, when it's the evening, whenever I feel that they're done and they're ready to go and they're out there. Um... So this way, all you have to know in the broad perspective of everything going on, there's content Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And that's the easiest way for both of us, I feel, because I'm not streaming like I used to, is like I was doing almost every day. I don't want to set to a schedule anymore because my schedule at work is always all over the place, which is fine. I don't mind that. And honestly, I've come to the point where I like making content more than I like streaming. I do like streaming again because it's the special days to get in touch with, you know, to catch up with people and everything like that. But the content coming to here and always going to be on here is the stuff that I'm really getting into, which is making music, doing the starting guides, doing the top reasons, things like that. Uh, doing a lot of photo mode stuff, which that's going to be something new. We're going to be working on too as a new project doing photo mode videos where going out and getting photos and then probably like fast forwarding the little all the little bells and whistles of making the photo and then the final thing so then i'll throw some music on the back of it and call it a day so yeah so that's everything all right we'll cut this by nine, 10 minutes but thank you again everyone thank you for all the subs thank you for all the comments you guys have been leaving the likes the retweets all that good stuff uh sharing this with your friends and everything like that i noticed that our divinity 2 top five reasons has blown through the roof it's over like two thousand views now which is amazing the goal is we get every video close to that if possible down the line but Again, that's always down the line. For now, let's just get a structured system of getting videos out on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. We keep that rolling, and then we'll see where it goes from there. So, again, thank you very much 
I appreciate all the support you guys have always given, and uh, guys and gals. And yeah, and that's it. So be safe, be just, and as always, I'll talk to you guys later. Let me hit this record.